planted by the water We shall not be moved So we would now like to get to the business of this public shareholder meeting and we are going to first and foremost call this meeting to order of the majority shareholders of the Federal National Mortgage Association and the Federal Home Loans Corporate Mortgage Corporation, the taxpayers of the United States of America. And Freddie and Freddie have refused to serve the best interests of the taxpayer by refusing to work with homeowners and refusing to reduce mortgage principal to keep homeowners in their homes and kickstart our struggling economy. The time to push Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac is now. The time for taxpayers as the majority shareholders to stand up and demand what's in the best interest of our neighbors and what's in the best interest of ourselves is now. Proposal one, <laughs> Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac should end all no-fault evictions after foreclosure and as an alternative to eviction should accept rent from occupants of foreclosed homes or sell homes to occupants at the current market value. Proposal number one. Proposal number two, Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac should approve loan modifications that include principal reduction to current market value for underwater homeowners. This would maximize the value of the taxpayer assets, our assets, minimize the continued impact of the foreclosure crisis on the housing market and benefit the economy, and keep families in their homes and homes occupied. That's proposal number two. We have over the last year asked Fannie Mae several times about renting the home, uh, what else we could do. They have all these things that they say they'll do and they've done none of them for us. Uh, we've offered to at least pay rent because that's what we can do at the current time. And they have either refused or not responded at all. We are a person that we work. We keep our house clean, safe environment for the family. And I think they, they will, they should accept are offered to rent at this moment because we still paying taxes. The, my neighborhood is very good neighborhood and I deserve to be there. I work hard, I still working and I still pay my taxes. And I think everybody deserves a home. In June, I lost some of my patients because I'm a home nurse and I had asked them if they could lower my mortgage. And they said no, so they sold the house to Fermi Mac. And I've been fighting with them and calling them and doing all the things I'm supposed to do that they asked me to do, to, and they still refuse. So I'm here to fight to save my home. Thank you. They bought, Freddie Mac bought my house for half of what I paid for it in uh, 2006 when she was born. Um, and I'm not going anywhere. We have a table, we have an offer on the table for rent. They have 14 days to get back to me, but all they're concerned about is whether or not I have counsel. So that's my story and we're not leaving. We're staying in our home. My kids go to the school right around the corner from where we live. I'm a volunteer with the Springfield Read Out Loud program. And I'm not leaving my home. So next up, we're going to hear from a number of families who can not only afford to pay rent, but could afford their home at the current market value. And now we're doing battle with Fannie Mae. Um, we're able to afford rent. We've offered to pay rent. They've refused. We, we, we're able to pay uh, for our mortgage at the current market value, but obviously they're not willing to do that. So today we're bringing attention because we've shed a lot of light on Bank of America over these um, uh, past months, but we, we need the public to know that um, not only uh, is Bank of America doing wreaking destruction on our community, but the federal government is working in tandem with them. I mean, how, how, how ridiculous is that? However, now we have to deal with Fannie Mae who own the, uh, uh, the mortgage right now. So uh, I currently um, I'm working with a uh, another bank that's trying to 
buy the house back, sell it back to me because I can afford it. We can afford the rent. We can afford uh, to buy it back. So we hope that Fannie Mae will listen to uh, the community, will listen to the taxpayers and do what's right for the people, with the people, by the people. Um, we own Fannie Mae. That's what you that's what it says. We are the majority uh, owners. So you need to listen to us and do what's right for us. If you would turn your attention here, you can see our proposals. And we, we thank Ms. Rose Webster-Smith for writing this up and Ms. Marcella Jane for pr helping to put it all together on this big board. So are there any? we'd like to see if there's any comments from shareholders. If not, we can go ahead and take a vote. All right. So we'd like to take a vote on whether to send a mandate to Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, and the Federal Housing Finance Agency. And our first vote is on whether Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac should end all no-fault evictions and either accept rent or sell homes back to occupants at the current market value. All those in favor? All those against, the motion passes. We have sent a mandate to Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae. All right, our second vote is whether Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac should approve loan modifications that include principal reduction to the current market value for underwater homeowners in the United States. All those in favor? Aye. All those against? The ayes have it. We have voted to approve. We're gonna beat, beat back the bank's attack. We're gonna 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 beat back the bank's attack. Fannie Mae are foreclosing on people, evicting people. Uh, we need to keep people in their houses. People who can pay rent for a house or could afford a mortgage at the current value of their house, that's what that's what we ought to be supporting and helping people uh, to do that. So Isn't I'm it, here to advocate for that. It, it's so outrageous that people can pay something and the banks are saying no. The, one, it's stupid, but more than that, it's immoral. And it's uh, it's just inhumane. And we need a society where people stick together and where we support each other and where we help each other out uh, in hard times.